You all know a lot about the benefits of broccoli. But do you know about its disadvantages as well? In this video, we mention six of the disadvantages of broccoli. Hello friends. Broccoli is one of the most popular vegetables in the world. Whether fried and used as a side dish or as a seasoning for baked potatoes. Unfortunately, many people overdo it knowing the benefits of broccoli. But you should know that consuming anything in excess is harmful. Damage to healthy cells and increases the risk of cancer. Broccoli is an excellent source of antioxidants. Antioxidants have many benefits and fight against free radicals in the body system and prevent oxidative damage to our cells. However, excessive consumption of sources rich in antioxidants, such as broccoli, in addition to targeting cancer cells, also targets healthy cells around them and increases the risk of cancer. Increase in intestinal, stomach, and dehydration problems. Broccoli is rich in fiber, which acts as a natural laxative, relieves digestive problems such as indigestion, irritable bowel syndrome, bloating and abdominal pain, improves bowel movement, and eliminates constipation. But if broccoli is used too much and you don't drink enough water with it, your body may suffer from dehydration and it may increase intestinal and stomach problems. Allergies and Sensitivity Broccoli is not useful for all people. Although broccoli is rich in vitamin, minerals, antioxidants, phytonutrients, it is not good for everyone. In some people, it causes allergic reactions such as difficulty breathing, wheezing, headache, and nasal congestion, skin rashes, stomach pain, and itching. Therefore, not everyone can use the properties of broccoli. People are probably allergic to broccoli who are allergic to cruciferous vegetables such as cauliflower, turnip, cabbage, etc. Please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell to get notified about new videos. Increased risk of hypoglycemia Because of its low glycemic index, broccoli is beneficial for diabetics or people at risk of developing diabetes. But if people with diabetes consume too much broccoli, they may experience hypoglycemia. Diabetic patients, especially people who take medication, should be cautious in consuming broccoli because broccoli may interact with medication. Blood pressure drop High blood pressure is the main cause of various cardiovascular problems such as heart attack, a stroke, irregular heartbeat, and so on. Moderate consumption of broccoli treats high blood pressure due to its potassium content because potassium acts as a natural vasodilator relaxes blood vessels and regulates blood pressure. But if broccoli is consumed in large quantities, the high level of potassium can lower blood pressure dangerously and cause hypotension.
Stomach upset in pregnant mothers and babies. Pregnant and lactating women can use broccoli in moderation because broccoli is rich in vitamins, minerals, antioxidants, and phytonutrients that play a significant role in maintaining a healthy pregnancy. And the folate in it helps to protect newborns against neural tube defects such as spina bifida. Excessive consumption of broccoli by pregnant women causes problems such as abdominal pain, intestinal gas, intestinal obstruction, etc. Excessive consumption of broccoli by nursing mothers may also cause stomach upset in babies. Please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell to get notified about new videos. If you have any questions or comments, I will be happy if you leave me a comment.